What's up? So, I got this old fan, the motor died on it, so it doesn't work, and instead of throwing it away, I realized that the body of it is made out of metal, so uh, I already cut off a little piece for something else. But I plan to take the body of this fan and turn it into a cowbell. So instead of making another cowbell like my last video, uh, this is going to be uh, a different type of cowbell. LP makes these things called jam bells. They're kind of like a go-go bells, but not exactly. So I plan to take this thing apart, use this body of the fan to make a jam bell, I guess you would call it. So, let's get started. So I don't claim to be the best welder out there, but this was like insanely hard to weld. So this the material is just way too thin. And as you can see, I misaligned it. So that's awesome. But I had this machine set to the lowest setting and it was still burning through. So that's why I like, you know, tacked it like a thousand times. And then it came back with like a, a somewhat full pass. But even still, they're like booger welds. You do what you can and there's nothing a good old flap disc can't fix. <laughs> Possible to clamp anywhere.
If your cutting fluid is boiling, you probably need a new drill bit. Alright, so I'm saying screw the drill press. I'm just going to drill this with a hand drill. I also found a different drill bit, so hopefully this one's sharper. sound the best. It sounded all right before I put the mount on, but now it sounds kind of bad. So uh, I'll put a little clip at the end for you to hear it, but I'll also make another video so you can hear it better. So I might come back to this idea. I might use a thicker metal because this is kind of too thin. I think that's why it doesn't sound as good. So if you want to see me make another one of these, or if you want to see me make something else, you know, percussion related, leave it in the comments and, uh, you know, I might make it. So thanks for watching.